The Emerson Sensei right here. Got this right off of Amazon. So, and I've already got the app downloaded to the phone, so we got that. Let's get this thing opened up, look at it, and then I'm going to start the install, which I've never done one of these. Could get good. Oh, isn't that nice and clean? Ah, there we go. All right, nice, clean. You got to see my ugly head. That's how everything just bolts right on. So, um, we got some instructions I should probably read. And here is the actual piece right here. All right, that's where your wires go in. So, looks like they're just simple push plugs. All right, it looks simple. Um, let's see here. Got some mounts going to drywall or something like that. So, pretty much. Um, ooh, look at that. You can see my phone. <laughs> uh, it looks simple and easy, right? I want to read the instructions and get to the install. Looking at the instructions, uh, obviously you got to create the Sensei, Sensei app. All that. You got to do that first, which... Like I said, I've already got it on here, so I uh, got that. That I've got to do, connect to Wi-Fi, register your account. So apparently, you got to use this to connect it to your Wi-Fi, so that's not a problem. And also, it says uh, the Sensei app will walk you through removing your old thermostat from the wall labeling your existing wires and installing your new sensei thermometer thermometer your thermostat so apparently the app can actually walk you through installing this thing so huh could be good uh, let me see select your thermostat i've got the good one i believe right here uh yes it needs to be installed gather tools packaging got all of that um, we got to do some drilling. Turn off the power. Why? <laughs> I don't need to turn off any power. <clears throat> do not remove your wires yet. Remove the thermostat cover. Blah, 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 blah. Take a photo of your wiring. Oh, I'm going to take a video of my wiring. <laughs> ah, yes. Okay, there's a jumper. Throw away any jumper wires. I don't see any on mine. Uh, pick terminals with wires attached. Pick terminals with wires attached. Okay. Okay, I can select it right here. Alrighty. Oh boy. Okay. Well, I guess I got to actually start the install. Ah, uh, look at this old ugly thing. Oh, let's see. Oh, okay. I actually had batteries in here. Interesting. So these are my wires right here. C, G. So apparently this is where I actually choose the colors of the wires and where they're supposed to go. Wow, bunch of wires. Looks like I've got a brown on E. Uh, I don't see the brown on E, but there's an E. There's a Y. I've got a O. I've got two of them on W2. I have the brown wire has actually jumped over to the W2. And... The R is on R. Okay. The G is green. My G. And the C. Uh, there we go. You've selected a valid configuration. All right. Next. Um, it's all electric. Label wires. Using the provided wire label stickers. Um, 
Okay, so... Uh, oh, boy. With the power off, I've labeled it just like the instructions say. And I've got the wires loose, everything off. So this is going to finish coming off. And the new back plate is going to go on. Okay, it's on. I was lucky enough I was able to reuse the existing holes and the existing screws. So uh, unbolt and bolt right back on. So hopefully I won't have to touch it anymore. Jeez, got some dirty hands around here. And now, just as I labeled each wire, they go right into the appropriate spots. Yeah. Whew. Okay, now this thing does have a light that you can put on the back of it. Not sure why you can't quite get to it like this, but I'll just leave that off. The power is still off on this thing, so... Oh, boy. I get totally nervous when I start to mess with stuff like this oh oh boy okay i'm gonna turn the power on now oh i can't believe it i may have got it <laughs> did i do it <laughs> okay so now i gotta go and scan go to the app because i gotta go to advanced setup i believe it is Maybe. No, 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 that's not it. I gotta go to the Wi Fi. All right, home kit setup, manual setup. Okay, so at this point, I'm gonna scan something. Scan the QR code in your Samsung. All right, so I'm gonna scan this one and get it connected. I guess. Yeah, okay. I should better just scan it. Let me go to my camera. This is the unit right here. You touch it. You got everything you can mess with right here. It works like a charm. You know, this right here, you got all these features and stuff. But rather than showing you this, which is pretty darn awesome because you can mess with all kinds of things, we're going to go right to the app because that's where you're going to use this the most. Now, guys, I've had this for a little bit here. I just want you guys to look at the app. You can actually hear it running in the background. So I've got some of my stuff set up. It's cool, heat. You can have it on auto. So it can actually cool and heat or however you need that to be. Fan, auto. I've got this set up for 10%, six minutes per hour. So that, you know, kind of circulates a little bit. You can totally turn that up. You know and have that fan just working a lot but i'm good with that right there the schedule i've got the program schedule and all that i don't need to mess with that uh, let me see here edit schedules let me see if i even got one in here there we go 8 a.m it comes on up to 77 we don't really need this thing cold in the day because we're both out at work at 3.30, it drops to 75 because we're on our way home. At 9 p.m., it's bedtime. Time to drop it a little bit more. So that, that just seems to work out pretty good for us right there, me and the wife. And then we have this right here, which is the usage. So as you guys can see, I've actually had it quite a bit here. You can tap on that. Two, and a half, two hours, 15 minutes cooling, hour and 37, just a fan. You come all the way up here Saturday. Now on this one right here, um, I actually ran it a little bit more because I was kind of home. Want a little bit more cool during the day and summer is coming. So almost five hours of active cooling. And Sunday, let's go ahead and just open all these things up. So you can totally see like when I'm at work versus on the weekends. So that's, that's pretty darn awesome. I don't know if I have any monthly archives yet because I haven't had it in there that long. But uh, overall, I really like the way this thing works out. And you can adjust your temperature right here. Turn it on or off. Hear that? Went right on off. So I really like this setup. I really do.